don't know how I start like every episode, right? Saying, oh, this game contains flashing lights, scary noises, and all of this weird stuff. Um, so I would have done that this time. However, uh, it stopped before I could even do that. So yeah, um, full screen. Anyway, hi guys. Hello everybody, my name is Crispy, and welcome to Remy's and Friends Revisualized. Um, this is a FNAF fan game. That's all I know. Let's get into it. Th that happens all the time. Uh, I keep saying, oh, this is a, a FNAF fan game about, and I never know what it's about. Anyway. Hey, Crispy. First off, I apologize for calling you at such a bad time. I know it's pretty late, and your place has just been renovated after what had happened. I'm still deeply sorry about that. You have my... It's fine. Don't worry about it. Why are you exactly calling me? Really? Did the color change? Earlier today, around 5 p.m., I uh, trusted you and the rest of, you, of your staff with my daughter's birthday party. Thought it was gonna be great, and it was for the most part. But okay, wait a minute. Am I reading the wrong color? Okay, I thought it was gonna be great, and it was for the most part. But uh, crispy. What? Am I am I stupid? Am I reading the colors wrong? I'm just gonna read it normally now because I don't remember how to read dialogue. I trusted you, and I never thought something like this would happen. You and the rest of your staff reinforced the whole security assistance aspect of your place, but simply does not live up to its... What is it, Mary? My daughter... She's gone. My assistant called, and he told me he simply did not find my daughter at all at your place. Right around the time the party was supposedly over, she was just gone. I need you and your staff to check up on this. It was your responsibility to take care of my daughter. It's not this. This is just not justified in the slightest. Listen, Crispy. I'll just say Crispy. No, you've had it bad recently, but it simply does not justify anything at all. Specifically, with all the, the reports and rumors that have been going on regarding your. Okay, Mary. Take care of it myself. Don't call me back. We will take care of it. Next time. Don't call me around this time. Hey, poor thing. I can't make sense out of everything that's been happening. It feels so aimless. It's about the time I figure out what to do. I really didn't know who was talking, so I, uh, my apologies. One, one thing, devs, I was just, I'm just gonna hope this, if they see that, because typically, honestly, typically, developers do you know, videos of games tend to get around. But anyway, I'm just gonna say, can you just add names to the captions or like fill in names or give them different colors? Cause I, I tried to do voices and that did not work. Also, Remise and Friends were visualized. I haven't played the original, so I don't know what the original vi visualized work look like. Also, my does this stuff. Looking for a job that allows you to stay up late and keep an eye on things? Look no further than Remise's Games and Grub, the hottest new entertainment dis destination in town. The company is currently seeking a night watch to join their team and help ensure the safety and security of this facility during overnight hours. The night watch position will require the successful candidate to work from sucking my balls. Um. Anyway, so my nose hurts. My nostrils are like completely tore up. So, um, if you hear me, sn my my sniffle. God dang it! Turn. Charge the staircase flash. Jose, that's hard. Explaining, as I assume if you're listening to this message, you already know what you're here to do. So, I give you a warm welcome to Rama's Games and Grub. You've been hired to watch over the place at night, monitoring cameras to ensure everything stays safe. First off, I'm the CEO and now lead owner of Calster's Entertainment. We've recently remodeled a huge portion of our animatronics and made other changes after my wife's recent passing. Thank you for telling it's me that. It's been really tough, especially for me. What? 
but I'm doing what I can to honor her memory and keep pushing forward with this brand. It's what she would have wanted, especially now as the lead CEO after her passing. Now, on to your procedures. Your main and most important tools are the security cameras, which you can access below. The place is huge, so keep track of every camera to monitor activity. Above your office, there's a panel used to manage the behavior of our animatronics and other systems. I'm not sure if you read this in your contract, but ever since my wife's passing and some odd disappearances, the animatronics have become more and more unstable and can't be turned off. It's been another challenge we're trying to manage. I can't go through everything, but there's key points of interest you need to keep in mind. Only my wife, Isis, truly knew how they worked inside and out. I understand the basics, so I'll explain. The stage animatronics tend to roam at night, which is why you're here. Keep track of them to ensure security. They might approach your office, attracted by the electronics inside. To keep them out, use the panel above. If they show up in front of your office, use the remote shutter. It can be accessed through the top panel. Pay attention to their eyes through the cameras. If their eyes are on, turn on the fast boot option and use the remote shutter. If their eyes are off, keep it off. Do keep in mind, this method is used primarily for both Ramis and Naren, being the main duo on stage. The White Wolf, Leroy, has a much different method. I'll get to this some other night. You're also here to keep an eye on the place in general. Make sure there are no break-ins or other issues. If any systems fail, you can reboot them through the top panel. The fast boot option is also in this same panel for reference. You'll get another recording tomorrow with more details on the rest of your equipment. For now, work with what you have, Jose. Thank you for being part of our team. We appreciate what you're doing. Good night. First off, I want to say, Jose, I know he's black. Let's not even, like, let's not even, let's cut to the chase, bruh. Let's cut to the chase. Do Who are you? Anyway, is this the first black man in a FNAF? Quick! Okay. Um, is this the first black man in a FNAF fan game I have ever seen? Uh oh. So he'll actually come, or they'll actually come into the office, by the way. I can't tell what it means by their eyes are on, per se. Like, is this on or are they off? What do we define as on and off here? So as I was saying, um, yeah, yeah, that's gotta be a black man. They brought a black man into a FNAF game. I love that. Thank y'all. I mean, I don't know why I'm thanking you. It doesn't really have much to, I mean, I am black, whatever. It's like weird wind gusts. Is it on or off? That was loud. Okay, I could not have known what was on and what's off, considering the fact that it was just pure black. I mean, I saw the white specs. Yeah, I, I guess I'll, I'll give you all that. Whatever, bro. Oh, no, I got a spirit. Oh, my God. Anyway, as I was saying, I was saying how, um, yeah. He's a uh, they put a black man in a FNAF fan game, right? It made him the night guard. First off, wow, <laughs> that's a first. That is a first. I don't think I've ever heard of a night guard in a FNAF fan game being any anything other than like named Michael. Well, I guess Michael isn't like primarily a a, a, a black or white name. I feel like that's anybody's name. But still. So thank I mean you know but Josh say that's that's pretty on the nose. Also that's I'm pretty sure that's also X's name. Uh, <laughs> X pull off. Am I right? <laughs> or John pull off. <laughs> it's six a.m. Uh, it's six a.m. What is going on? Oh, please don't tell me they do this BS where it's like, you go until 7 a.m. actually, um, because this is FNAF, or this isn't FNAF. 
Please do not tell me I go until anything past 7 a.m., bro. Y'all know better than this, bro. False hope. Let's go at 7. Time to head home. Sorry about that. My nose is just killing me, dude. I, I took some daytime medicine, and I don't think that's going to help. I seriously don't think I'm going to be in breathing form. Jacob. Jacob's ladder? Like, from... Okay. Really home. I wonder if my sister's here. ASD to move. Press space to interact. Do -do -do -do. Sorry. I got this all. Oh, turn on them lights. Tyrone. Alright. His room's locked. He's probably keeping himself busy at work. Emma. Well, my sister's been coping healthily. Hey. Are you okay? Are you drunk? Jesus Christ, okay. Wow. Eesh. Oh my god, thank you. You brought me back to the menu. Alright. We're gonna play two nights of this. Probably two... Yeah, I'll do two nights right now and I'm gonna take a nap. And then I'll do three. And then that's how many uh, nights this episode will have. Because I have a curse of if I play a game for too long, and then I just start sucking balls at it. Just yeah, Speaking of balls, actually, I started Dan to Dan, but I'll talk about that after the call. So hold on. Hello again, John Faith. This recording should be shorter than the last, though there are key things I need to discuss. We are aware of your concerns regarding the various systems, including the vent on the right side of the office. As I mentioned before, we haven't gone through everything yet, so I'd appreciate it if you stop desperately asking questions and wait for personnel or me directly to explain things to you. As part of your contract, you are expected to await for answers. Right, Staff buddy. and all personnel are already stressed out with everything happening lately, including the disappearances, my kids included. You need to understand how hard this is for all of us, myself included. So please, quit with the petty demands. We have too much on our plate, and we don't need your needless interactions with the rest of the personnel. You're a bad person. It's about the job. You can quit anytime. We can always find someone to replace you. Now, moving on to what you wanted to know. I'll explain two key things. First is the alarm available through the cameras. This was recently redesigned to scare off anyone breaking in while being monitored through the cameras. It's also used for one of our animatronics a rather old one we haven't been able to ship to our warehouse so he stays here for now this particular model was part of the previous set we were placed with a newer revision and as such behaves differently his name is alex alex is mainly guided through the core alarm routes both hot and cold he can be lured away using the system based on the color of his eyes if you hear him turn on if he even does Check the cameras quickly until you find them. If his eyes are red, use the heat alarm. If his eyes are blue, use the cold alarm. One of the main reasons I find your demands petty is because this particular model hasn't worked for years. It's the oldest model from the previous set and hasn't functioned properly in a long time. Now, I'll do a much more what? brief That's... explanation. No. I mentioned the White Wolf animatronic last night and the fact that he had a much different method. This particular model is far more advanced. He can access the vent on your right and also run towards your office. In daytime stages, he performs much faster movements compared to the others, as he's designed to be the most agile of the group. This agility is notable in his free road state at night. So, if you see him in the left hallway and he approaches your office, Wait for him to run towards you. To talk faster. Turn on the remote shutter as fast as you can. Don't worry about the batteries. It doesn't matter to him. Due to his advanced moves, the ISIS designed him to be streamlined, avoiding the need for specific management because he's so fast. If he crawls through the right bed, just stay close. Yo, okay. 
okay all right so small issue um you guys took that took so long to get through all right bro so they just took so okay hold on sorry let me calm down <laughs> that's okay they took so long to get through the the tutorial that i could not focus on what the night actually was because I sat here looking at two animatronics in my hallway for the first time. I'm sitting here trying to figure out what the heat and cold alarms are, and I can't find either of the two, by the way. Um, and I'm sure I'm probably just blind and I haven't seen it yet. But, like... Bro. I didn't know... Okay. Because, dude, they explained it, like, last minute. <laughs> I, I thought he was going to walk into my room, and then I use the remote shutter. That's why I didn't use it yet. Click his icon to play his vent sound cue? What are we talking about? Okay. You can't give me instructions in the tutorial. And then... Because look, now I'm not going to be able to hear the tutorial. Bro, you guys just acted... Oh, oh, oh. I thought these were the meters. My fault. Okay. The heat alarm makes sense to me. It's just, I really, really, really really would prefer i would prefer if i had a bit more visual uh not visual i'm just struggling sorry hold on i cannot think dude it, my nose hurts what my nose is hurting, by the way. It's, it's so bad. I'm, I'm gonna keep bringing this up brashly. Go, oh, dude. My aim is atrocious today, dude. I haven't played Fortnite. If I play Fortnite, there's like a 20% chance that my aim is actually significantly better when I play. I'm looking for a little ice man, but you know, Mr. Mr. Temperature, but I can't. <laughs> I don't know where he is. I don't know where he is. I'm confused. How am I supposed to know? Fire alarm. He takes a while to attack, so you can deal with him last. Click his icon. I didn't know where he was. I couldn't hear him. What? What was his cue? I'll upgrade. Because I decided to play games with me. The fact that I lived from that was astonishing. The fact that y'all wanted to turn off my stuff the second I wanted to use it is insane. So is that just gonna keep happening? Because I, I really hope not. And I thought he was supposed to be in the other the, the vet room too, but uh, okay, yep. <laughs> Thank you guys. Thank you. I don't know. He will approach from the left when he runs. He's, he's in the net avoid making any noise. I didn't make any noise. I didn't make any noise. Don't make a noise, right? Don't make noise. No noise. a little bit more sense if you know what sound cue to listen for um otherwise you have no idea what you're doing 
thing. Also, I'm still, despite the f Ugh, sorry, despite the fact of me doing that, I actually don't understand the mechanic entirely of the white fox. Um, I think the mechanic is a little bit too unexplained for me to get it yet. But, and I, um, also I didn't get to read those, so I said, hopefully I can go to school tomorrow, or, or something like that. But, the thing is, is they don't really explain how you're supposed to entirely, use a missing poster? Um, how you're supposed to know commits what oh wow good boy um and you know are you not gonna interact with it lady okay whatever sorry i did it again um yeah so um or, hold on maybe i had to press s uh they don't explain that fox mechanic very well I just don't understand how the whole sound thing works. Like, do you, you just don't do anything, I'm assuming, which is cool and all, but what happens if something comes into my office? Do I have to then deal with it while I'm under the presumption or what? I'll be at home. I mean, I, I'd assume they already thought of something like that, so. I don't know, though. It could just be me. I'll be sober now. Probably not. So hope he's sober the guy in the uh, the guy last time was tyrone it's my room oh my god he was not in fact sober i guess wow yeesh at least i don't think i mean that could have not been the same person because this time we didn't get to talk to them um anyway right that was Ramiz and friends were visualized uh this is actually a very good game so far like very high quality i love that the models of the animatronics um actually very cool features i mean there's nothing wrong with this game so far i mean wow i'd say they're going for like a 8.7 out of 10 so far so that's cool uh but yeah uh i'm sick so i'm i'm, I'm, I'm done for today <laughs> or at least i don't know i don't think i'm done for today i might upload another night you know to go along the slide this we'll see if you like this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, please show you some love. See you guys next time. Peace.